Well, hey there, Leo, and welcome to your forecast from the Gasmic Tarot as we expand on the July energies in this intuitive and channeled reading. It is still a general reading, though, so, wow. So you uh, might want to look at the forecast for your moon, your rising, oh, there's one I fell your Venus, wow, okay, um, don't know what those are, there's a link in the description, just falling all out all over the place, okay, this is a general reading, so take what resonates with you and leave the rest for everyone else, all right, so let's see what we have here. Wow. I, I, I'm sorry. I know. I keep saying wow, but if you see what I'm seeing here, we have the transformation card. All right. And transformation is about change. You know, the only thing constant in life, it's not death and taxes, honey. The only constant in life is change. Just want to point that out. You know, nothing remains the same, and you need to accept that life evolves through cycles. Change doesn't have to be scary. It's just different. All right? So, you know, it's that whole cycle of life. And now's the time that you're getting ready to transition to move forward into something that, from the looks of it, is going to be bigger, better. You know? And you're not, you need to allow this to happen. So don't get... If, 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 don't get so caught up in any kind of negative emotion towards this. You know, everything happens for your highest good and let go of the old. Once you let go of the old, you can welcome in the new. You know, if you're filled with 90% worry, you only got 10% room left for everything else. I know somebody needs to hear that. Just saying. Okay. And we have the tower. And in this deck, the tower is about surprises because things are really trying to move and shake and happen really fast. You know, this is about a total paradigm shift. You have transformation and the tower. Things are really shifting for you and suddenly and quickly. So this, this, the rest of this month, you're shifting, you're moving, you're growing you know, into something better that's going to take place. You know, maybe you're having, maybe the epiphany will, the light bulb will turn on for you. The epiphany will present itself, that synchronicity, that big idea. And then you'll say, oh, I had to do this in order for this to happen. So remain present, keep your eyes open, keep your ears open, keep your... Um, again, open-mindedness is the key here. And then you've got the magician. Ding, ding, ding. You've got the magician. And this is about alchemy. This is about aligning to spirit and creating what you want. This is about talking it out. You know, for those of us, including myself, who have Leo in the chart and say, hey, you know, what do I really want? And laying in bed and going, well, you know, I think this is what I want. This is, this is definitely what I want. And I start talking about it. And then, you know, the universe hears that and puts things into place. And when we do it, we're doing it in a positive way. Hey, you know, I really appreciate everything, but I think this is the direction I want to go into now. Do you get it yet? All right. Let's uh, already pre-shuffle these, but let's do a little quick shuffle. And then we'll determine what kind, what deck, I'm sorry, we want to pick. You can tell I haven't had a lot of espresso yet today. Okay. Oh, jeez Louise. Go ahead. Let's just throw that out there. That just bent out of shape. Okay. Totally. Well, let's do that. Okay. Which one, which one, which one? This one. Okay. What do we got? What do we have? Yeah. So as you're coming into this period, it looks like you felt, you know, when something, you know, when you eat something and you're like, yeah, that's not really what I want. 
Have you ever had that before? Let me grab a little coffee. Espresso, actually. Um, you know, you eat something, you're like, eh, you know, that was okay, but it's not satisfying your taste buds. Well, life, you know, even though things might have been coming easy for you or easier than a lot of other signs during, especially during the pandemic, um, eh, something doesn't feel, you know, fulfilling enough. You know, maybe you're getting money and you're just like, yeah, you know, it's money, but I don't feel that vever, that delicious feeling, that passion. Uh, and so things are shaking up for you. <laughs> oh, if you haven't felt the passion, you're going to feel something soon. Uh, yeah, and it's all about expansion. So you're coming into a period of great expansion. Maybe some of you are expanding the house you're in. Um, renovations, um, you know, maybe you're putting on a deck. Maybe you're, you're re renovating the interior of the home in some way. Um, you're definitely expanding some of you spiritually, um, energetically. Relationships are, are, are shifting and expanding, and you're going for the gusto and what you want. Yeah. And through the rest of this month into the beginning, you know, you got the star. And the star is about inspiration. It's about being inspired. I'm moving forward. I'm taking no prisoners. Ideas are flowing. I mean, really. <sighs> Ideas are flowing. You are breaking out. You can see what you want. Visualize it. And you can, you can taste it. You can almost touch it. So you are really changing on who you are. And we got the double shake up here <laughs> that just th flew out of the deck. Wow. And we have the double magician here. So we also have the magician. We've got the magic happening. We've got um, you being able to say, hey, again, this is what I want. Here it is. And when we say it, we don't say it. Oh, I wish. <laughs> don't do that. Okay, sorry. Somebody's spirit's talking through me. I'm usually not that rude. A little, a little rude. Uh, but it's about, hey, I have a clear picture of what I want. All right? And here it is. This is what I want. This is what's the direction I would like to go in. Spirit, help me get there. Boom. Wow. And you get the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. Money, luck. So this direction, this new or expanded way that you're doing your business or, uh, or what you want is going to give you opportunities to make money, to build relationship. Um, the cycle is new cycle opening in your favor here. To the happy ending. Son of a gun. Okay. To the happy ending. This is about, the 10 is about that happy, uh, what I call the happy ending. The um, things coming to fruition. Celebrations. Uh, all right. Somebody spirits coming in and saying there's also some kind of celebration in the relationship front. Uh, some kind of commitment. Uh, commitment. Uh, ceremony that you are, a commitment um Ceremony like, you know, it could be a wedding, uh, that you're going to uh, or that you're participating in in some way or that you're making a commitment to someone or something. Really amazing. What do you got? Yeah, you're putting down roots. You're putting down roots. You're moving forward. There's nothing that you can't do. This is the time to celebrate and you will be celebrating. Yeah, okay. You're asking for this because you're saying, hey, I need more out of life. Um, I need to move in a direction that's going to, where I can follow my joy, follow my passion. And so you're starting to ask because things are going to, okay, well, what's next? Yeah, okay. You know, you're looking for that deliciousness. And the universe is going, oh, really? Okay, we'll give it to you, you know. But really transforming and coming into your own, realizing that you are the magician. You are the alchemist here. And you can do anything you want if you put your mind to it and your heart and your energy.
All right, guys, that's all I've got. Thanks again for your likes. Thanks for your subscribes. Really appreciate you. And uh, enjoy the rest of the month. All right, take care.